So 2022 is the hardest year yet for MIPS as we move out of the transitional phase of the program. Simply reporting MIPS may no longer guarantee penalty avoidance. If you are a practice that hasn't reported since 18 or 19 due to the pandemic, when a penalty could be avoided with just 15 or 30 points, 2022's requirement of 75 points is significant. If you are a practice that has been reporting all along, 75 points is significant. So either way, definitely a challenging year. Uh, due to the combination of budget neutrality of MIPS and the automatic COVID EUC granted to all individuals by CMS the last two years, uh, incentives have been low or non-existent. However, if automatic exemptions are not given by CMS in 2022, there is potential for higher earnings. While not all clinicians and groups will meet the minimum threshold, starting early and earning as many points as possible will help mitigate the potential for a negative adjustment and maximize your success. It will take an intentional team effort, so be sure to share these changes with both your clinical and executive teams.